welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm gonna do a little face mask video for you guys. I got this from the store and I wanted to try it out. It's a tea tree peel off mask. So I'm guessing it has tea tree oil in it and tea tree oil is supposed to help um, with like inflammation on your skin like for pimples it's supposed to smooth out your pores and everything so that's what i read on this face mask that it's supposed to do um this face mask is by seventh heaven and i tried out seventh heaven's other face mask i think it was charcoal and that was really good so i decided to get this and try it out for you guys on camera don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. I don't know if you guys can see, I have like a pimple right here, right here. So hopefully this can help out with treating it and everything. The other mask that I tried by 7th Heaven, it was, I think, yeah, I tried out the charcoal mask before and I tried out something else by them. That face mask was like pretty clear and then it dried blue. So I think it was the Dead Sea mask I tried, but this is a tea tree oil mask and as soon as I opened it I just got like a a whiff of tea tree oil so it's that it's that potent so and it's green so you guys can see that I don't want it to drip all over my desk but. my hands are clean by the way <laughs> here because I have a mirror that I just got from like over there on my white my white shelf so that is why I'm looking over here but also I'm trying out this mask for the first time and you definitely don't want to get this near your eyes or like touching your eyes at all because since it's tea tree oil, it's very strong. So my eyes are kind of like squinting because it's so strong. It's kind of bothering my eyes a little bit. what I said before but I don't know if I forgot to mention that this is a peel off mask it's not like a clay mask or obviously because it's clear but it's a peel off mask <laughs> everything well that's covered all my face I put it on my nose I put it on my forehead to like here I didn't take my glasses off because I wouldn't be able to see what I'm doing so um, put it on here my cheeks my chin and I didn't put it on this part I know some people usually do but I, I just avoid that area cuz just makes no sense to me but um, I'm gonna let this sit on my face till it dries and then I'll be back and when it's dried I'll peel it off for you guys but it's kind of it's very minty because it's tea tree oil I'm really trying hard to keep my eyes open because it's so minty and it's not even it's not even that much near my eyes I just stopped right here with my glasses end. so yeah also I just got some on my lip yuck all right I'll be back for you guys in just a minute a few moments later all right so a little update you can definitely tell that my face mask is dry but it's not all the way dry there's so, still some parts like right here the lighter parts there that are still a little wet and I can't touch but for the most part, it's dry and my face is tight and I can barely move my mouth to talk. <laughs> 
but um, yeah, you could definitely tell. I'll leave it on here for a few more minutes so I can start peeling it off. This part wants to peel off, but it has to wait. All right, so the mask is wanting to peel at the edges, so it's time to take it off. Apparently, you're supposed to peel masks up. I don't know what that does. If you know, comment down below and help me out. <laughs> I find it so satisfying to look at the stuff that came out. You can't really see it, but it's really, really teeny tiny. Just little bits left that I will get off in a little bit. This part hurts a little bit. How? Clean up my face now with some toner. Love this stuff. I use Dickinson's Witch Hazel Toner. I've tried other brands. I forgot what it was, but um, I've tried another brand besides Dickinson's and it doesn't work on my face. It leaves my face sticky and it feels, it feels, it leaves my face sticky and it doesn't smell so good. It reminds me of mouthwash. So I always use Dickinson's. I always will stick to this. So what I do after I do any type of face mask and after I wash my face twice a day, I just get my toner and I get a cotton ball. I just put some on there and just put it all over my face and it kind of just gets what the face mask or from washing my face, it gets what the cleanser doesn't get. And it kind of deep cleans your pores too, so. My face feels very clean. Now, it's the middle of the day and this morning I washed my face. A little after 2 right now, it's almost 2.30. Now my face feels like I just washed it. Yeah, I like the face mask. I will definitely get it again. Only downside is that it's very minty and your eyes can get affected too. Well, not affected like you can't see, but like affected like it'll be hard to open your eyes so just keep that in mind if you're going to try that out and reminder to self not to put it so near my eyes maybe i'll stop like right here just put tiger strike right there but um i hope you guys enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up and if you want to try it it looks like this or they have it in bottles apparently and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Also tap the bell to get notified every time I post a video. I only post once a week so I won't bother you guys. So I will see you guys in the next video. Have a great day. Bye.